Preparation on making homemade farmer's cheese. Pour one gallon of milk into a metal bowl, then add one cup of buttermilk and leave the mixture in the bowl at a room temperature for several hours. During this time, the milk should begin to curdle and turn into porridge-like substance. In our case, this process took about 8 hours. Now turn on the stove, set the temperature to a very low, and place the pot on the burner. Allow the mixture to simmer for approximately 3 hours or until the milk is completely turned into curdle and it's separated from the liquid whey. This is what it looks like when the curdle has completely separated from the whey. Now we need to remove the curdle from the mixture. For this purpose we will use a strainer. Place the strainer in the empty pot then pour the content of the metal bowl into the strainer separating the curdle from the liquid whey. Next, place a small plate on top of the curdle and apply sustained pressure by placing some type of a weight on top of the plate. Allow the curdle mass remain under pressure for about an hour. It is now time to remove the pressure by removing the weight and the plate. As you can see, the curdle has become more consistent. Um, now you use a spoon and slowly mix the curdle and you will see it, that it has minimum amount of moisture. Congratulations, your homemade farmer's cheese is now ready to be used. Enjoy your meal.